What's up, everybody? My name is Dave. Welcome to Pixel Panic. Um, if you've been following along, we are playing Castlevania Circle of the Moon. And we are doing terribly. Um, I'm frantically trying to figure out where to go and what to do. And I'm getting my butt whooped doing it. Um, so this has been quite the chore. Uh, this has to be the door. There was that room up above, I think, that I passed on sliding through. Not you. Oh no, I couldn't slide through. Big difference, okay. And... That was really dumb. And this one was just the power up. There was one up here that I did. <laughs> they can't believe they keep doing that. I'm sure you can't either. Like, there's gotta be an end to his stupidity. But unfortunately, there is no. There's absolutely no end to the buffoonery when it comes to me playing Castlevania on the Game Boy Advance. Look at that. I mean, it's just, it just has such a weird delay to it. Doesn't feel very organic. Okay, so this is all new turf. Will you move? Okay, so that's the back side to this one. Okay. I probably could have put that together if I was thinking. So, it's giving me a lot of these... Oh, I should have ducked faster. It's giving me a lot of these, um... Increases. Which I was excited about before. But now I feel like maybe it's a little bit much. Like, I feel like I'm not really earning them. Having to go through as much to get them. Ooh, the axe. I haven't played with that one. Oh. I normally don't care for the axe in Castlevania games. With the exception if there's like a limit or a break for it, like a, some sort of an item breaker. But. I don't think there is in this one. Okay, so we've milked this room. Pretty health. So, hmm. I get the feeling that the only other option now is Cerberus. Like, it's the only realistic progression. Oh, oh my gosh. Hey, look at that. I missed him with both my axes. And then ran into the bombs. Mom, Dad, I'm so sorry. I can't Castlevania. Why can't I Castlevania? They're gonna be like, our son is a failure. <laughs> Disappointment to us all. Can't Castlevania for his life. The really sad thing is, like, I used to be really good at Castlevania games. But it's, again, this one has a weird combination of being 
like Castlevania 1 style feel of controls and character combat and then Symphony of the Night level layout so it it's a little disjointed in that way I guess I know I use that term to describe stuff often that is a cloak of some sort Okay. We will go to that. Also go over here to this safe spot. it this way. Oh, you turd. I cannot get used to this. Totally hit jump and it did not go. Ah, jeez almighty. Yeah, um, so the delay is definitely a something. And it's right there. I was running, wouldn't jump. And I don't know if that's because of the fact that he has a delay in... And look at that. Then that one was like a totally impotent jump. Please, somebody in the comments that's maybe played this before, tell me whether it's the game or... Oh my god. We got him. Awesome. Sorry if I got quiet there for a second. That got a little intense. I took all of my cunning. Get it, you little turd. I am concerned that I will not make oh look at that yeah but I'm now concerned that without some sort of health bonus I will not make it back It is going to take nothing to kill me. Okay, I got to get up and to the right. Oh, 
Oh no. We did it! Yes! Oh yes. And just in time. Fantastic news. I am super proud of this. So, um, we beat the Cerberus, got to the save point. We now have a rockin' hot double jump. Um, this game's starting to get really good. I'm glad if you've hung in there that you've done so. Um, and we'll get a little bit further the next time on Pixel Panic. Don't forget to comment below if you've got some tips um, or things that you want to point out. Definitely comment if you've played this before and you know that the controls are kind of weird or from just really crappy uh, or a combination of both. And uh, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button or I'll kill you.